Hello everybody. So today's video we are having something a little bit different. So I don't know if any of you remember but a few weeks ago I was asking you guys if we had a remote viewer amongst us. Anyway, long story short we do have a very talented lady amongst us and she has been beavering away with a few things. One of the people she has looked into is the man who goes by the name of Marcus Anderson. Now you guys know we've done a bit of work on Marcus Anderson before. We don't think that's his real name at all. Our remote viewer takes it a little bit further. The surname Anderson does have significance to him. It is a nod to his past, his heritage but allegedly it is not his real name at all. The remote viewer also found out some other tidbits of information. Marcus Anderson's parents, or the man who is known as Marcus Anderson, his parents passed quite, well, he was quite young. He was brought up by an auntie and uncle. It is this auntie and uncle that introduced him into the dark arts, shall we say. So our remote viewer picked up that allegedly Marcus Anderson, the man who is publicly known as Marcus Anderson, is involved in dark, demonic worship which explains why so many psychics, so many readers have a difficulty getting to grips with the man who likes to be known as Marcus Anderson. Now, allegedly Prince Andrew knew exactly who Marcus Anderson was and who he is and what he's capable of and his link to Megan. And what our remote viewer found out is quite shocking. So she found out that Megan wasn't meant to marry Harry. She was just there as a disruption. She was meant to cause some damage to the royal family, the whole kind of thing, not welcoming, etc, etc. But she was meant to bail before the wedding. So that means her and Marcus have gone rogue. Marcus Anderson's quite happy to go along with Megsy because it's energy. It doesn't matter if it isn't good energy. You can draw on that kind of energy being a dark practitioner. It's something he's quite happy to watch somebody humiliate themselves. Now Marcus has a strong link with Doria. He also has a strong link there with Oprah and all of these people are dark practitioners, allegedly. Now, if Megan ever went rogue from Marcus Anderson or he got sick of her, he is quite capable of, I would say, more or less destroying Megan. However, he is very much enjoying the drama the fame, the notoriety, and it's, I guess he must be getting some kind of kick from being so in view of everyone and no one knowing anything really about him. Now our remote viewer did an amazing job and the, he has got so many blocks up and energetically, not only has he scrubbed the internet, but he's energetically, he has got barriers up, a lot of barriers up from people finding out who he really is. So I'd like to say a big thank you to our remote viewer who is anonymous at this time but you never know they might decide to announce who they are themselves but I would just like to say a big thank you for doing this work. It's a difficult work to do and these people are very energetically wonky shall we say so thank you so much for doing this for us so we do appreciate it and it's very interesting how this is all going to pan out because i think we're going to find out more 
about Mr. Anderson. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.